Good morning, students. Welcome to BMS online class. This class for class 11 students. This is your first class. I am Kausik Kundu, your computer teacher. So, you choose, I think uh, some of them students uh, choose physics, chemistry, science students especially, physics, chemistry, maths, bio, some of them uh, update physics, chemistry, maths, computer. So, today's class for computer students, computer science CS code 083. Okay. So, first of all, when we start with computer, computer knowledge, some programming concept, let us clear why we choose computer science. Today's situation, this pandemic situation shows that everything is online based because we are in home. So, everything depends on new technology based on computer or smartphone, isn't it? Okay. So, there are two different things. One is CS, another is IT, information technology and computer science. In, suppose this is an information technology. This is an information technology or you can say this is a information technology okay and it is a over computer science. That means one is system software, another is application software. Computer science based on application software and as well as system software, but information technology based on application software. Okay. So, the first thing is why we choose computer science and class 11 syllabus, also I told you the whole syllabus for class 11. So, uh, the first thing is what is computer? What is computer? Computer, the words came from compute, which means calculate. But today's, in this situation, or we use computer in different segment in our life. So, these segments start from our railway reservation, banking sector, education sector, everywhere we need computer to calculate something or do anything. Suppose we make a design for a building, we need computer. So, everywhere computer So, this situation CS computer science or information technology is the main part in our life. So, computer which means calculate, but today's date not only calculate any logical operation also we any logical operations we use computer. Okay? Now, difference between CS and IT. So, computers mainly uh, three, uh, two parts that is software and hardware. Software which is not touchable and hardware which is touchable. Clear? And computer mainly depends on input, process, and output. These are the functions in computer. So, in information technology, in information technology, 
which is basically an application software which is basically an application software suppose ms word where we write anything this is a part of it and when we make this ms word it is goes to computer science okay so computer science that means when we make a software we need computer science so software what is software software is a collection of programs in information technology software definitions are which is not touchable that is called software but in computer science language the software definition collection of sub programs a called software programs what is programs a sequence of instructions a sequence of instructions form a program suppose i told you to learn about a uh, sabot your uh, daily routine or uh, write your daily routine in a copy so you first start on morning session followed noon session afternoon session evening session and end with night session you can't start in that way first start night session then afternoon session then morning session then noon session it is not possible it is wrong way to describe our daily life so when we give an instruction to computer it should be an sequence of instruction and sequence of instruction execute computer and give us an output okay so software is a collection of programs programs is a set of instructions this is the language used in computer science okay so programming language in class 11 you have python programming language python programming language some computer fundamentals knowledge number system and sql last chapter will be your cyber security okay so the first things we have to do the knowledge of programming language what is programming language programming program is a set of instruction a language through which we can communicate through which we can communicate this is called programming language computer only can understand zero and one so the language is digital and there are three types of language high level language middle level language and low level language high level which we can understand middle level in between high level and low level and low level only computer can understand so there will be a little confusion how can we convert high level to low level low level to high level because when computer give output some low level then we can't understand if we write an high level or english communication language we use in computer then computer can understand so we need compiler and interpreter language translator it is called language translator which can translate our language to computer language computer language to our language clear so compiler and interpreter okay why we need this type of programming concept why we need suppose i told you 
add two numbers 5 plus 5. So, you just write 10 325 plus 725 then you can add 5 plus 5 in that way you can add these numbers and it takes several times and lots of times you need if we use 325 into 725 this takes lots of time so we use calculator calculator we use and easily calculate the output so in computer why we need programming suppose we need several times several times suppose 5 plus 5 then we need 3 to 5 to 7 to 5 829 to 129 in that way lots of addition result we need so we use a code like calculator and easily there we put some concept of programming and when we required just execute the program and calculate these outputs only give the inputs to the computer and computer calculates this and produce output within a seconds or milliseconds or nanoseconds so in this reason we use programming clear suppose we need a software which calculates some or which use for some account purpose like tally okay so there will be a suppose uh, we have an organization where needs some calculating uh, where needs some calculating software which is not closer to tally or any other software or calculator this is a new version or new customized software we need so in that portion we use some programming codes and creates a software for our organization our e class portal is also like that i think all of you aware our e portal class where you use some programming concept and creates a software and this software helps with lot because there will be a separation of class separation of subject separation of teachers you choose any of them from this software and there you will find some youtube videos which helps you lot in your subject depth so this is the main difference between cs and it it only the upper portion of system software that like an application software if we not create or develop a system software then it can't work so this is the main difference in python why you use in programming language or why we use programming concept that's why we use programming concept several times i told you to sum this number this number this number this number but if you write a code and execute several times just give an input and computer can calculate and out produce the output then it will be easy for us that's why that's why we need programming concept suppose i told you print your names 100 times or 1000 times you just write suppose i write here bms okay it will be written in 100 times so i write here bms 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 but when uh, we know about the 
python programming concept then we use there a loop concept and in loop we just introduce just put this bms value and it will execute computer after when it is executed in computer then produce the output 1000 times bms that's why we need programming concept so today's topic computer input process output working features software hardware what is software in terms of computer science language compiler interpreter language translator okay so this is the end of first class now second class will go to python and python programming concept how we will write a python program okay so thank you thank you very much stay home stay safe bye bye